guys, welcome back to my channel and this is your teacher SP. For today's video, I'm going to teach you how are you going to multiply and divide an integers. So last week, I have already discussed how are you going to add and subtract an integers. Paano ba mag-add? Paano ba mag-subtract ng integers? So ito po para po makompleto po ang four fundamental operation po natin. So if you are interested in this video, let's start. Guys, let us start. When you are multiplying an integers. So like for example, you have to multiply a negative uh, two numbers having a negative sign, then that is equal to positive. So negative times negative will give you positive. And if you're going to multiply a positive times negative will give you a negative. So this is very simple. When you are multiplying a two numbers, Having a like sign, negative times negative, the product is equal to positive. When you are multiplying two numbers having unlike sign, positive times negative will give you the product of negative. But if you are multiplying a positive times positive, the result is still positive. This is very simple. Take note, guys. If you know the rule in multiplying an integers, like signs, so uh, I am teaching my students, if you are multiplying two numbers having a like sign, then the result is positive. When you are multiplying two numbers having a like sign, the result is negative. So this is the basic rule in multiplying an integers. In multiplying an integers, guys, is the same as the rule in dividing an integers. So I will give you an example for multiplication so example number one negative five times negative three so two numbers then the result will give you positive 15 or you can write 15 meaning even though you will not write positive sign there in 15 the the meaning is 15, positive 15. And if you are multiplying positive 18, okay, so this is positive 18 times, so positive 18 times negative 3, then the result is equal to negative 54. Okay, and then for number 3, I will give you two positive numbers, 20, times 30 then the result is equal to positive 600 so ibig sabihin kapag positive kahit hindi na po ninyo lagyan ng sign ang ibig sabihin ng positive but if the result is negative kailangan po lagyan ng negative sign so this is the rule in multiplying an integers this is the basic rule very easy as what I have mentioned just now that the sign or the rule in multiplying integers is the same as the rule in dividing an integer. So I'm going to give you an example. Okay, so when you are dividing a negative divided by positive, the result is negative. Okay, teacher SP, can I use this symbol in dividing? Negative divided by positive the result is negative same if you will use this one the operation that you are going to use is also a division or if you are going to use this one the the uh, operation that you are using is also a division when you are dividing negative divided by negative the result is positive Positive divided by positive, the result is positive. So, in short, when you are dividing 
two numbers having an unlike sign, a negative and positive, the result is negative. When you are dividing two numbers having like sign, negative and negative, the result is positive. Positive and positive, the result is positive. Same as the rule in multiplying an integers. So if you are going to apply the rule, guys, so like for example, okay, so example number one, I will give you negative 18 divided by positive 2. So the result is negative, right? So negative 9. Or you can also use this one, negative 18 divided by positive 2, same as negative 9. So either you will be using this symbol, either you will be using this symbol, symbol same as division. Okay, another example number 3, if you will be using this one, negative divided by negative. Okay, negative 64 divided by negative 8 will give you positive 8. Ma'am, is it possible, Teacher SP, if uh, I will not use the positive sign? Yes, pwede rin. Kasi same than positive. Kahit hindi niya po lagyan ng symbol. And then for number 4, so uh, I will be giving you positive 36 divided by positive 4. The result is positive 9. They're all positive, so okay lang kung hindi po lagyan ng symbol. So that's it, guys. These are the rules in uh, multiplying and dividing an integers. So that's it, guys. I have already discussed to you how are you going to multiply and divide an integers. So I hope that you learned something today and uh, see you on the next lesson. Have a great day, everyone.